Hey everyone, welcome back to a new episode today. I came up north for a bit of an explore and I found this awesome rock pool. It's just fish everywhere in it. It's really deep, really nice. And I came up to do a little, not catch and cook, but just find some things along the rocks that you can eat. Try them out because I've never tried any of these. So this area that I'm in now is sanctuary zone, so I'm not going to take anything from this area. I'm going to head up the coast a little bit further to a little bay that's not sanctuary zone and I'll collect some nice animals from there. So see you there. So I'm out here on the rocks, I'm looking for three or four things. First one's periwinkles, which are these little things just here. Second thing's a sea urchin, mussels and oysters. Because they, periwinkles are just everywhere on the rocks. So you can get a few of those. Sea urchins are in the water, but you can occasionally find one in a rock pool. And mussels are along the rocks, just like oysters. Found one. So just after getting these mussels, there's a little sea urchin in there. Hello, little fella. So I've got a sea urchin, periwinkles, and mussels. So I'm gonna take, put them all in a bag and head back where I'm gonna start a fire just over there. So while that's heating up, I'm just going to fill up a little saucepan full of salt water to cook the periwinkles and the mussels. Just boil them today. For now, I'm just going to let the water heat up on the fire. All you have to do with the sea urchin is just crack it through the middle, that kills it, and then inside is the yellow row. That's the, that's the eggs, that's the part you eat of the sea urchins. Doesn't taste too much. Pretty, it's a little bit fishy, but I'd happily eat that, yeah. It's pretty nice. There's something that comes out of that, it's pretty damn nice. Obviously the bigger ones would have a lot more row in them, a lot more to eat, but that's, this size is the only size I can find. I'd have to go for a swim, want to find the bigger ones. But, I'm staying dry today. And I'm eating weird things. 
close enough for me. Straight in. They seriously don't need very long, maybe. Well, I've never had them before, but by the size of them, I don't reckon they need very long. So I'm only gonna give it a couple minutes. For the periwinkles, I just brought toothpicks. I only need one. So I brought a toothpick along with me. Just want to get rid of that first layer. It sits on top of the periwinkle. And the toothpick just goes side. So it's really, you only get probably a quarter of a mouthful, not even. Wow, they, they're like mussels. Wow, they're seriously tasty. I'm actually really surprised. That's, that tasted really good. I think you'll be able to tell in my face that I was like, shit, it's pretty tasty. Oh, I missed a little bit on the first one, so you get a lot more than what I thought. Seriously? Just a tiny muscle. So these are probably gonna taste the exact same. Just a bit bigger. Should have brought some soy sauce with me. Wow. That's just that's so good. Don't forget, always put your fire out. Yeah. Try and leave it how you found it. Because it's just such a wonderful place. You don't want anything to ruin it. gonna drink on the beach take your rubbish with you so disrespectful so I was perfectly surprised those periwinkles the mussels I've had before and I love mussels but periwinkles first time sea urchin second time and definitely something to try yourself I don't think I'll call this catch and cook because you know I just <laughs> just boiled the water but I guess it is a catch and cook so that's it for our catch and cook Anything I call a catch and cook. <laughs> well, maybe it is a catch and cook. That's it for another episode. So, I'll see you guys next Tuesday. Remember, weekly uploads. Don't forget, like and subscribe, comment, anything you want to know, questions. I try my hardest to reply to everyone. And follow me on Instagram, offshore underscore underscore adventures. Post heaps of, heaps of other content on there. Now, I'll see you next time. That was close. That was close. <laughs>